Jose Suarez was building the American dream. Jose worked long, tough hours in construction, sending all of his money to his wife and children, spending all of his off time with them. That all changed on January 28, 2014. Jose was working on a boom lift in the Brazos River, helping to build the pedestrian bridge leading to the Baylor football stadium. The boom lift on which Jose was working went into the freezing cold water with Jose attached. Jose was unable to escape any After Jose died, the family hired us because they wanted answers. They wanted to know if Jose's death could have been prevented. We got to work immediately after we were hired. Luke left no stone unturned during our investigation. We spent more than a year investigating the case, interviewing more than 50 people by deposition, and securing thousands of pages of internal construction documents. What we discovered was truly disturbing. We learned, among other things, that there was no safety people on the site at all. We learned that Austin Bridge and Road, the company in charge of the bridge project, had known for at least five years that the work was not being done following the safety rules. And we learned that Austin Bridge and Road knew that workers like Jose were exposed to drowning risks, but didn't do a thing about it because they wanted to rush the job to make more money. We learned that Jose's death was completely unnecessary. Austin Bridge and Road refused to accept a single ounce of responsibility, so we had to take them to court. We presented the evidence that we had discovered to the jury over two weeks, and the jury, after listening to all of the evidence, found that Austin Bridge was negligent, grossly negligent, and 100% responsible for causing Jose's death, and they assessed almost $18 million in compensation to his wife and children. Although nothing will ever bring Jose back, we were thrilled that a jury of Jose's peers decided that enough was enough, that the health and safety of workers is the first and not the last priority, and that companies like Austin Bridge and Road that take shortcuts with worker safety will pay a steep price.